Why would Logan leave half our own army to die when a blight threatens? Whoever you are, I... Wait. I know you. My son described you in great detail. Okay. He tells me that I owe you his life. When I saw my poor boy's legs, I only wish how still lived that I might tear him apart myself. I would bring troops against his son. But Oswin tells me Thomas had no part in his father's depravity. Is there anything you would ask as a reward for saving Oswin? Thank you again. Know that I will stand behind you at the lands meet with all the support I can muster. In fact, I am taking my supper today with Van Reginelder of the White River Venor. I'll uh -huh. speak with her about this at once. Even you must admit there's a suspicious rash of mortality among the advisors. What are you looking at? We're the Crimson, Crimson Ors. Ors. You haven't heard of us. We're mercenaries from all over the world. We have won many battles, and tonight we drink before the next. We happen to like the ale better here, the wine too. Less vomit on the floor. So long as we're paying, they're serving! Ha-ha! <laughs> Ha-ha! <laughs> you may have a point. Bar woman, you and your women are too old and shriveled. Too many damn clothes, right, boys? Ha-ha-ha! <laughs> Horns, we go to the docks. Let's wind us some winches! May I help you? This is Ermenrix. Explain yourself. My brother would no more part with this ring than with his head. He's alive then? Please, if you have any news of my brother, I would hear it. Well, good or bad news? A dungeon? What? No. I will go to him at once. Someone will answer for this. Take this with my thanks. It has been in my family since the War of Crowns, crafted for us by the Circle of Magi. An heirloom is a small thing compared to my brother's life. Oh, I haven't been there for ages, so let's see what happens. This should play out a bit differently. Andraste, bless you, sir. I won't forget your face. No, I won't. Now that is a big tray. I wonder if the children get to climb it. <laughs> Ballister. How can you be here? How many of our... I've got children at home. I can't wait out here for another day. So go home. The best thing you can do for your children is not trust these charlatans. Does everyone we know her. We will help as many as we can today, so long as we can do this in an orderly fashion. Oh, you're helping us, are you, Shem? Like Valendrian and my uncle Syrian, you helped them, didn't you? Help them never to be seen again. I've explained this to you before, girl. More whining will not persuade us to let you into the quarantine to carry plague back out to the alienage. Quit trying to get us all killed, Shiani. Some of us have still got things to live for. If this spell of theirs works, why are half the people they quarantine perfectly healthy? A, a bit sus. I don't believe it. Maker's breath. They said all the Grey Wardens died with the King. Everyone thought... Valendrian even held a funeral for Well, that's sweet. Cousin, you have no idea the 
The things that happened after your wedding, I'm babbling, aren't I? I'm so happy to see you. Wedding? You're married? <laughs> I was betrothed. It didn't end well. Still, you never told me you were betrothed. Ah. What happened? I... Alright, that does sound bad. So much has happened. It's good you're home. He's at your house. He was staying with Alaris, but... Well, things are a little tense right now. A lot of yeah, people Yeah, but what's happening him. here? Can you believe that? They blame Soros as if he were responsible for what the new Arl did to us. Yeah, we were kind of guilty of that. All these gifts, and it's not even my naming day. Uh. You just don't care how much trouble you bring down on us, do you? Must be nice to be above your own people. Who brought Vaughn here in the first place? Tell me what we did to deserve that, and maybe I'll start caring what you think, idiot. Elves wind up dead in the market gutters every day over a wrong word or a look or nothing at all. That's how it's always been. We fight back or we submit, but it doesn't change anything. I'm not about to shed a tear over that butcher house death. If I could, I'd kick his grave marker and dance on his ashes. Uh, well, maybe we should go somewhere so you can be sitting down when I tell you this. Uh-huh. The Tevinters quarantined your father yesterday. I told him not to go to the hospice. Not one elf they've taken in there has come out again. Who knows what's become of them? I knew you'd do something, cousin. Make her watch over you. There is no need to push. We will work our spell for each person in... Viserion's mercy. How long have you been ill, woman? You should have come here days ago. You may not yet feel it, but anyone can tell by looking that you have been infected. Uh -huh. Both light diseases carry some of the taint, and in you, it is as obvious as blood in a bowl of water. A grey water. There's a hefty reward for your help. Take her down. We'll split the Okay, they were mercenaries. <clears throat> The winter card. Hmm. What do the winter want want from here? I mean, Maybe it wasn't <laughs> most uh, intelligent idea to get tell that we we were gray borders. 
Hey, what's with the elf? items here. spell power plus 10 chance to dodge dodge attacks yes please plus one spell power point uh, 25 mana regeneration in battle ah um, okay i think yeah she has pretty pretty okay ropes of possession sorry well, that's one way of getting through the front door. Are you going to go inside? She remem remembers that we this. kind of killed many, many of the house um, guards. Thank the maker. Please hurry. It shall be done. Pretty sus. Bring eight males and six females. Are they slavers or something? Help us, please! We're not sick! Let us out of here! Thank you. I knew the things they said about you weren't true. <laughs> what did they say about me? What happened they to my father? A few hours ago, through the back alley with the others. Oh no. And now I can see them. You don't have to say that twice. Who's there? Stay away. I can't say nothing. Please, just go. I don't want trouble. I don't know. I swear. I only saw them take people away. Took yes. Them right out of their beds. Drag them down the hallways. Baker, the little one's crying. They took him through here yesterday. Looked like a dead man. Oh no. Through the landlord's old office. They go in there, they never come back. Every few days, they come back. It's like a parade, a silent one. Men and women and children. You have to go. They'll be back soon. They'll find out I talked and they'll take me too. Please, just go. What is the meaning of this? We were told that there would be no interference from the authorities. You simply fought your way in here to ask questions, did you? Yep. You will regret this, you know. Believe it or not, we have been given dispensation to do our business here. The humans talk a great deal. So, uh... You are an elf. So this makes us kin? Don't be a fool. I am Tevinter first, and a servant of the Minrathu Circle ah. second. Those are the things that matter. But enough. I am here to halt your slaughter, nothing more. I am no fool. I can see that you are capable. 
So be it. I will let Caladrius deal with you while I fetch the Regent's men. I suggest you leave while you still can. Look there! A cunning trap! It's a trap! It shall be done. And that's why we have a <laughs> rogues with us. Nice that you can actually sometimes talk your way through without battling, but yeah, it's mostly bashing some heads in, in this game. Imperial Edge. Well, that's not bad at all. So, that this must be it. I am Caladrius, and you, I assume, must be the Grey Warden I've heard so much about. One can hardly get a word out of the Regent besides Warden nah. these days. It's surpassed even gold in popularity. Now, now, is this how we begin? With bluster? I was hoping for civility. <laughs> I've heard that you're trying to erode Logan's support. It must be a difficult task, yes, like washing away a mountain. Perhaps you could use some help. Truth be told, there was always a limit to how long we were going to be able to operate here. We've paid for many of Logain's troops, but once the lands meet is done, we become inconvenient. So, here is my offer. One hundred sovereigns from you for a letter with the seal of the Terran of Guaren upon it, implicating him in all of this. Then, we leave a few days earlier than planned, with our profits and remaining slaves unharmed. Tis a reasonable enough starting <laughs> offer. I feel dirty. We're not considering this, are we? So, do we have a deal? Even you must admit it's much better than resorting to barbarism, yes? Interesting. <laughs> now, that's not much of a deal, is it? <sighs> Let's do this the hard way, then. Men, shall we? This, this might be a bit more difficult battle. Seems your reputation is an accurate one. I surrender. Mm. 
surrender? I don't think so. Uh, I already butchered those who were hurting elves, so I, I think I'm going to go with the same same role here. Wait! Hear me out, dear lady. Were I to use the life force of the remaining slaves here, I could augment your physical... So he's offering an even more you evil deal. Allow me to leave this place alive, and I would be more than happy to do this little service for you. Hmm, an interesting offer, if a tad messy. Little service. He is talking of blood magic. Surely you would not consider such a thing. Most wise. Uh, then, um, I don't suppose you would consider just uh, letting me go. No, I don't, I suppose I would. Oh. Well, that is a shame, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Daddy. See you again. When they said all the Grey Wardens died at Ostagar, I prayed they were wrong. Are you all right? What are you doing here? I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You're so much like your mother. She'd be... Well, proud really doesn't describe it. This isn't a good place to talk. Come to the house. There's something I should give you. Yeah, slaver documents. Robes of the Majesty's the Lords. So now we got some robes. I think this 10% chance to dodge attacks is pretty okay. Sure, she can get a uh, plus 6 defense, but still it's uh, those uh, stat bonuses are not as important at, at this phase of the game. What, uh, and Morrigan? It's resistance and feel power. Ah, and spell resistance. Morrigan has a spell resistance in her robes and a lot of defense. Magic and cold uh, damage, sure. <laughs> Not, it, it doesn't look much, but it's pretty okay. Thing I actually remember these arrows, which are stunning arrows, so he couldn't cast spells at the at the end of the battle. I shall do it. Uh, anything more here? Probably no. But yeah, this game kind of gives you chance to play really evil if you if you want to
Is someone there? Make us blessing to you, child. Be not afraid. I still have some sight to see you by. I appreciate your candor. Most stare. Or worse, the awkward silence. I am a Templar. I lost my sight in a battle with a powerful Malefica. He called flame from the air and burned my face. The scars have healed, but my sight will never recover. In my time in the alienage, I've come to feel there is something sinister at work here. Blind Templar. What exactly, I know not. It took patience, but some elves opened up to me, and I've heard their sad tales. But I found no real evidence to support my fears. Ears alone have done all they can. I was hoping you could be my eyes. Look around the alienage for anything out of the ordinary. I don't know. I have a feeling that there is something to be found, though. You seem capable. I have hope that you will find what I seek. Make her watch over you, child. Something even more wicked. It shall be done. Cousin, you're amazing. Which I shouldn't say to your face because it'll go to your head, but it's true. Are you sticking around for a while? You're staying for dinner, aren't you? You'd better. I'll weasel a bottle of wine from Alareth and we can catch up. I'll hold you to that, cousin. It's the shop. Under the dead dead dog. I wonder if he's interested in that. What have you found? I'll report that at once. I've heard such afflictions can spread, even from a corpse. I suppose someone may not have known that. Hmm. That's by the orphanage, right? A sad place. Did you find anything else? You weren't here for the riot, then. You are most fortunate. When the elven riot was being suppressed, the orphanage was stormed. It was... bad. Very bad. Have you found anything else? Not unprecedented. I have heard of similar problems throughout Denerim. One odd thing I am willing to believe, but two is no coincidence. Let's head to the orphanage. Both of your clues were near there. For a blind man, he is pretty good at moving around. The feeling is intense here. This is the right place. Okay. I know not if it's the work of the Maleficarum, but there is definitely evil here. You go first. I will follow. Ah, uh, ladies first. Okay, this haunted house. Clear it. Do you hear me, Sir Willem, Sir Willem? I'm a fallen Sir Willem, Sir Willem today. I'm a maiden, Sir Willem, Sir Willem. But I'm dying, Sir Willem, Sir Willem. Okay. As you say. Though the golden city has fallen, I have seen your face and your light. I am your... Save your pedantic chant for your sermons, Templar. You have killed my brood. 
The Maker compels you. Show yourself. The Maker. There is no Maker. There is no golden city. But there are demons. Yes. Evil folk. I hear not your blasphemy. By Andraste and all the divine after her, I order you to face me. You delusional fool. A big one. I don't think horror would work for demon, but yeah, what do I know? We have done it again. I feel the darkness receding. I have seen the work of demon before. Some malefic carum consorted. The maker must have guided. Them. Ouch! That's a big fork. second round There's more of them. That one. Situation is not is is not good. Not at all. Uh, who's who's needing healing most? too hot so let's cool down a bit
kind of worked, but yeah. The Batman. They are quiet. Uh huh. Call for blood no more. It's my grandmother's. You found it, well, sir. Pretty co I close. I feel. I feel like a mist is leaving. Oh, thank you, sir. I have to. to live my life. Ah, there you are. I was about to send out a search party. I've been hearing of a great commotion in the alienage. What exactly happened there? The winter mages and apostates. Maker, forgive me. I should be appalled that such a thing could exist here. But I'm overjoyed you can implicate Loge. We must end the civil war quickly. What the blight does not corrupt in this land, politics surely will. The last of our allies have arrived in the city. We cannot delay any longer. I will call for the lands meet to convene. Bring Alistair and join me at the palace as soon as you are ready, Warden. Funny how the royal palace is next to the slums, but yeah, that's that medieval city planning for you. Warden, I am not surprised it has come to this. And Alistair, if you were even remotely worthy of being called Merrick's son, you would already be in the Lands Meet, now wouldn't you? You have torn Ferelden apart to oppose the very man who ensured you were born into freedom. Uh -huh. But do not think you will get past me to desecrate the Lands Meet itself. The nobles of Ferelden will confirm my lord as regent, and we can finally put this to rest once you are gone. You say that with such... such righteousness. Loghain used to have that ring in his voice. He has not sounded that way in yeah, many months Yeah, he went now. to the dark side. It is not... so clear an enemy when it is your own people you fight. What was he supposed to do? You and Eamon were harassing him at every side, forcing him to empty the treasury to fight you. He never wanted a civil war. After uh -huh. Cain died, everyone was supposed to rally, come together to fight the Darkspawn without crying to Orlay for aid. He never anticipated Merrick's bastard would challenge the throne and force this war. Caelan was a fool. He brought a spoiled child in his ancestor's palace. He never knew what it was to be hunted, to starve. Maybe the Grey Wardens killed him, or maybe my lord let him die of his own foolishness. Either way, it may have saved Ferelden. You think war is simple, don't you, Warden? You only fight monsters. No one sheds a tear over the death of an ogre. Torture is an ugly business. But sometimes it's the only way to learn what your enemy intends. And it is much harder to tell who the enemy is when all of them look like you. I can end the threat you posed at the Welder. Two arms, men! I really doubt it. and ladies of the Landsmeet. Tyrn Loghain would have us give up our freedoms, our traditions, out of fear. He placed us on this path, yet we should place our destiny in his hands? Must we sacrifice everything good about our nation to save it? A fine performance, Amen. But no one here is taken in by it. You would attempt to put a puppet on the throne, and every soul here knows it. 
The better question is who will pull the strings. Ah! Here we have the puppeteer. Tell us, Warden, how will the Orlesians take our nation from us? Will they deign to send their troops, or simply issue their commands through this would-be prince? How much Ferelden blood does Orlesian gold buy these days? Some of us are curious, Loghain, about precisely what happened at Ostagar. So, one of Kaelin's killers would dare speak of betrayal. You led our king to his death with your grandiose tales of griffins flying into battle. Please go on. The Landsbeak longs to hear a proper tactical analysis of Ostagar from an elf. You goaded him into making that charge. He believed the tales, Warden. He thought your handful of men would turn the tide for him. Strategy and consequences be hanged. What would you have me do? Kalen's was not the only life in my hands. Should I have sacrificed the entire army for his mistake? Do not imagine that you can shame me with Kalen's death. He was Marik's son. My king! No one regrets his loss more than I do. Indeed. Do we not owe it to Merrick to see his son on the throne? Yeah. If he were a Point. true son of Merrick, I would not hesitate to swear fealty to him. But I see nothing of Merrick in this pup. But enough of this. I have a question for you, Warden. What have you done with my daughter? You took my daughter, our queen, by force. Killing her guards in the process. What arts have you employed to keep her? Does she even still live? I believe I can speak for myself. <gasps> Lords and ladies of Ferelden, hear me. My father is no longer the man you know. This man is not the hero of Riverdale. This man turned his troops aside and refused to protect your king as he fought bravely against the Darkspawn. This man seized Kaelin's throne before his body was cold and locked me away so I could not reveal his treachery. I would have already been killed, if not for this Grey Warden. So... Warden's influence has poisoned even your mind. I think Nora. it was you who did it. Protect you from this. My lords and ladies, our land has been threatened before. It's been invaded and lost and won times beyond counting. We Ferelden's have proven that we will never truly be conquered so long as we are united. We must not let ourselves be divided now. Stand with me, and we shall defeat even the Blight itself! Southreach stands with the Grey Wardens. Waking Sea stands with the Grey Wardens. Uh -huh. Dragon's Peak supports the Warden! Oops. Western Hills is with you, Logan. May you help us. Oops. I stand by Logan. Three to two. No Three against two. I'm with Logain. Who else could defeat three the Blight? Three to three. Logain, I'm with you. This bodes ill for us all. The land's meat has spoken. Following these Grey Wardens has cost us our king. We must not allow it to cost us our country. I charge Eamon, Alistair, and this Warden with treason. Someone escort my daughter back to her room. Take the traitors outside to await execution. To arms! We will not be taken without a fight! For okay. In the Maker's name, stop! We will have order. Agreed. Let there be no further bloodshed in the Landsmere. Alistair's right to the throne is challenged. 
His challenger's honor is in doubt. In the past, such disputes were settled by duel. Will the lands meet agree? Yes, if it will avoid further bloodshed. But it must be fought according to tradition, by strength of arms only, in single combat until one party yields. Do you accept the terms? It is you or me the men will follow. So, let us fight for More you. More violence. <laughs> Prepare yourself. Let me go. Right choices this time. You were like Kalen, a child wanting to play at war. I was wrong. There's a strength in you that I have not seen anywhere since Marek died. I yield. Wait, there is another option. The Tean is a warrior and general of renown. Let him be of use. Let him go through the joining. There are three of us in all of Ferelden, and there are compelling reasons to have as many Wardens on hand as possible to deal with the Archdemon. The joining itself is often fatal, is it not? If he survives, you gain a general. If not, you have your revenge. Doesn't that satisfy you? Absolutely not! Riord, this man abandoned our brothers and then blamed us for the deed. He hunted us down like animals. He tortured you! How can we simply forget that? You can't do this. My father may have been wrong, but he is still a hero to the people. Honora, hush. It's over. Stop treating me like a child. This is serious. Game of Thrones. You, never you, grow you. Up, Honora. We know your. They remain you six years old with pigtails and skinned knees forever. Father. Just make it quick, Warden. I can face the Maker knowing that Ferelden is in your hands. Yeah, maybe it was a bad idea to put Alistar for this. Yeah, very well. Because we, we need uh, Anora for to lead the country. I mean... <laughs> Apparently she gets all of us splattered. So it is decided. Alistair will take his father's throne. I accept this decision. One of the proudest mo moments here. If the lands people have me. I'm afraid it's not so simple as that, I hardly think you're the appropriate person to mediate this, Enora. Warden, will you help us? Sir, 
certainly. Surely that's not a serious question. I have been the ruler of this nation in all but name for the last five years. I can lead for Alden. Alistair can't. If you give him the crown, then you've only brought us a brief pause in the Civil War. It will resume again at the first opportunity, and it won't end until a new dynasty holds power. I hope your route is clear here. Make me king. Anora isn't an option. Shouldn't I be? You're the one who convinced me to take a stand after meeting Goldana. I can do this. Yeah, he is, he is a bit. As the arbiter of this dispute, what is your decision? Who will lead for Elven? I believe Alistair and Anora plan to marry and to rule jointly. Now we have a fourth option. We do. I believe this is what King Merrick wanted. To see his blood tied to my father's to begin a new line of Ferelden kings. I may be Merrick's son, but I am also a Grey Warden. I took an oath. I swore I would stand and fight the Darkspawn no matter the cost to myself. I can't break that oath just to wear the crown. I have to go with my fellow Warden to face the Blight. Until then, I shall stay in Denerim, and rule in my husband's absence, as I did for Kaelin. So no, nothing much Alistair changes. I trust shall reach a more heroic ending. My fellow Grey Warden will, I hope, take Loghain's place as the leader of my armies. Shall we finish this thing together? Everyone! Get ready to march! It's going to take all of Ferelden's strength to survive this blight. But we yeah, will face it! it. This was more happy. We'll defeat it! More happy Ferelden ending. Is on you all. End ending. It's not over yet. We have still a... Uh, army and... Well... Archdemon to beat. We need to talk. I'm not going to question why you made me king. I even think I'm starting to come around on the idea anyhow. It could be an interesting future interesting. for Interesting. Being king, being engaged to a Nora, that raises some questions about us, about you and me. It doesn't need to impact uh, on us at all. You don't think so? Maybe you're right. Oh. But I've thought of it's good to be a king. since the lands meet. First, there's the fact that both you and I are Grey Wardens. Not just a question of obligation, but of blood. You know that Grey Wardens don't usually live to become old, right? As king, I will be required to have a child. Even more so because my death is assured. That's assuming that someone with the taint can or even should have a child. I... Yes, I suppose she would. If we can. Even one parent having tainted blood is not recommended. But I suppose I'll have no choice. Anora is going to be my wife. She will have my child, if I can give her one. I may not love her, but... I will Sacrifices. have a duty to king. I love you. More than I ever thought possible. But... I have to face what this means. I can't run away from it anymore. You mean, marry who I want, carry on with whomever I want? 
You don't think that would be very unfair? To my wife, as well as you? Oh, kind of. Uh, being... Being a king is <laughs> not, a, it's not a punishment, that you're is that. right. Of course you're right. Damn them all, anyhow. If they want to make me king, then... Then I'll be king. And I'll do exactly what I want to do. I feel like such an idiot for bringing this up now. Can you ever forgive me? Good. Then let's forget about it. Al Eamon has left for Redcliffe. He says the army has gathered there and is almost ready to march. As soon as we're ready, we should head to Redcliffe ourselves. The blight awaits, right? The end game awaits. Hmm, quest the final battle. Sure. So basically this is this is why I need to harden the Arlestad that he's he's open to being a king and doing what, what he feels is, is right. But yeah, uh, valid valid points. Points here.